Hi, this is bus pass renewal system. Just right click the import the application and right click it. You run as Android application. It will be executing as it is. So the application is executing. Here you have an option called start. Just click on it. Here we have two two options, administrator and user. Just check the message. Dear Grayson, your bus pass is renewal successfully. Uh, who are the who are all the users registered for bus pass and it is expired means uh, the, uh, today it is 22 now. So 22 is it is expired means it will be sending an SMS to the respective persons who will entering into the application. So we'll click on the particular button, any button, administrator and user, you will get a SMS. Same like administrator, if I click, you can find a message over here. So at every time it will be giving an alert regarding the expiry of bus pass for two users uh, i'm registering two users that's why it, it, it shows a uh, two user messages now we'll see how to register in this application just go to user you have option called login and registration. I register for, for a new user. The registration. Already two records are registered. That's why it will give uh, three over here. Here I type. Mobile number, you have to enter the correct mobile number. So that's it, you submit. It will be sending an uh, OTP to your mobile number. So give a mobile number properly. Since it is an emulator, so, so that here I toast the high security password that is 4775. You OK. Automatically the registration will be completed. See the IDS4. So this way you can register. But the administrator has to give approval for your registration so that you have to enter into administrator. Username is admin. Password is also same admin. Here you have options called view registration, view users, bus pass, request and sign out. Just like go to view registrations. Here you can see one user is not yet get, getting registration and the registration uh, acceptance so just click on it are you sure yes so registration is accepted now you can check the users list New users list you can see the registered users first pass request In bus pass request, two users are already uh, requested. See the status as accepted, accepted. Sign out. I just log in as a user. See, while the main page comes, automatically SMS will be sent to the respective persons regarding the expiry of bus pass. Here, this is a user page. Apply renew bus pass view status. If I go to view status, oh, no records are there. So I need to first uh, apply for a bus pass. Apply a renew the bus pass. Applicant name. From place. From there, just click over it. You'll get uh, options over here. For demo purpose, I can set any any two time, two date. I can set any date. 
we need to show the expiry alert that's why i set the same date as a two date you can set any date no issues in it 23 january uh, any year you can set any month you can set no issues in it just set the february 22 2019 instance contact number bank name card number cvv you can say the bank details will be debited over here you can see the details like bus pass registration completed it will be giving a confirmation sms to the registered mobile number now i go to apply renew bus pass over here means automatically my details are coming directly if i give, give a submit again it says sorry your bus pass application is already in progress so you cannot edit until the user uh, administrator will be giving approval or rejection view status is previously it is empty now it is saying status is processing so now we have to go to administrator and here you can find one detail like a uh, venkatesan and another person will be receiving a sms regarding uh, the expiry the new registration will not get a expiry over here because the expiry will be february i think that's why so it is not giving any alert over here just login as administrator pass pass request already two pass requests are uh, i showed two pass requests now you can see the new one yeah new one will be coming to the first so i'll just select it if i give s means accept no means reject i give x okay pass pass request accepted successfully status is accepted now how they can renew the bus pass i will show that how they can renew it once they can get acceptance or rejection they can do the further process it won't be giving any uh, disturbance over that here just log in apply a renew bus pass view status is it will be showing accepted now we'll go for a apply a renew bus pass and now i want to renew my bus pass like a 22 february 2 that means a uh, jan 1st to june 1st so i give a registration for that i mean renewal for it I give submit if i give again the submit means you will get a progressing message so you can st uh, check the status also it will be saying again it will be in processing stage yeah processing stage sign out login as administrator login request see the expiry date will be changed uh, to the applicant uh, here first jan to first june select over it yes processing will be changed to yeah accepted now i give sign out only one thing i need to show now clearly see two persons will be getting sms for expiry one two okay two persons will be getting expiry message now for demo purpose i just change the delivery uh, i mean uh, end date two date as two day date for this last registered is also
Okay, I'll set one day pass. So 22 and 22, I'll set the from date and to date. See two person only getting a summons for this one. Present request that means third person request. See here 22 December. I give accept for it. Just see what you have. First path request accepted successfully regarding that the SMS will be sent to the particular recipient. If I give sign out, we need to show three messages will be pop up like I just give sign out. Check it now. Summer sent for first person. SMS sent for second person. SMS sent for third person. So, expiry alert will be immediately producing. No issues in it. Thank you.